Hello everybody, this is Richard Sispinis and I'm here with a video upload to help you become motivated and inspired to develop and excel in your telekinetic abilities, your psychokinesis which is much more broader abilities. And uh, this is just a video tutorial that kind of very simple straightforward tutorial for everyone. How to be inspired and motivated to excel in your psychokinesis abilities. And uh, you could use almost anything in your life to be inspired. I'm just going to give you a few things to be inspired, anything, any small thing, movies, music, family, life itself, and you see career, teamwork, creativity, it all inspires. Now we're looking at this leaf right here, nature, you know, the love of, of nature, earth, you're seeing, seeing things through the eyes of a child, seeing things new, fresh, you know, um, seeing things in a small scale and appreciating it, being humble of life. You know, everything about yourself is, is connected to the earth and the earth is connected to you. And you can find inspiration by just uh, allowing yourself to be self-provoked, to be self-awakened, to manifest, you know, the interest and the magic in you. And you can see this park right here, the beautiful uh, sun being piercing through the bottoms of the leaf. You know, it's just, it's just so inspiring and so motivating. Let the smallest things of your life perpetuate your telekinesis abilities. That's my saying. Let, let life's joys perpetuate your telekinetic abilities, your psychokinesis abilities. Because life is too short. You can see this photo. You start off as a child, you get older, go to work, get old, and you go and you die. You know, you see, you got to learn to appreciate life. See, life is a miracle. You know, appreciate the smallest things. Let your heart awaken and become joyful by playing games with your brother or sister in the room. You know, um, visiting a grandmother in, in, the, in, in, in her home. You know, taking care of, of animals in a shelter. You know, um, if you want to be inspired, inspire others. You know, uh, um, like, I don't recommend living vicariously through others, but, you know, in, in a way, we have to detach ourselves from ourselves to, in order to help others, to help. When we help others, we help ourselves. And also, if uh, if you need more inspiration, you know, having children, having a child in your life completely radically changes a male's perspective on life. And that perpetuates your way of seeing what life is worth. And right here, family, family members. You know, being around family and just enjoying their presence. Now right here, I want to talk about this inspiration. I remember the first time I spun a little small paper PSI wheel. You know, this was really like two weeks going into telekinesis when I first started in September, somewhere around there, late September. And I got, I rented uh, uh, the Avengers, the second one, the Age of Ultron. And after watching it, I was so inspired by the film that after watching it, I went to the living room and put the PSI wheel together. And after using all the, the techniques that Trevor Seven taught me, and I was patient, I let my consciousness go out and let the object move where it wanted to go. And by this, and by just a simple inspiration, it, it, I did it. I moved the PSI wheel. The PSI wheel moved, and it was all because of just a simple film that just aw awoken my imagination, my creativity, you know, uh, magic, you know, like relationships right here. And be inspired to help anyone, like the homeless and everything, because we are equal to them. And just because we're different from them and uh, when we're cleaner, we think we're better than them, we're all the same. We're thinking crazy, doing telekinesis, but at the end of it all, without clothes, we're all the same. Help each other. Okay, now here's a few clips uh, showing an insight of my creative process on how I create and whatever. This is a dance move that I invented back in 2012, early 2013. It's called the Mars Walk. And... Um, Really, this clip was the very first ever clip that I uh, uploaded on YouTube and uh, uh, really to tell you the truth, I really didn't know what the hell I was doing. But I did know that I wanted to do something new and different. And what I'm trying to say is that sometimes you have to put yourself in un unrecognizable situations, make a fool of yourself. Um, in order to get inspired, you have to do un things that are unorthodox and make yourself uncomfortable and make yourself look like a fool. But at the end of it, you know, you get some creative things. And I've, this is the tiptoe moonwalk right here. This is the statue glide right here. And this is all from just being creative. And, and psychokinesis, you know, uh, we live in an age where, you know, people think that you're doing telekinesis, you're crazy. You know, this guy's wacky, it's, it's not real. We have to just believe in ourselves and provoke and manifest belief in ourselves and being self-inspired. 
manifest self-inspiration and we can do it and you know i believe in you and i hope this video helps ricky cespedes thank you guys for watching